One of the most popular Airbnb properties in the world is located right here in Atlanta. And amazingly, the owners say about 80% of its overnight guests are from right here in town. The reason staying at the Atlanta Alpaca Treehouse is truly like visiting another part of the planet. Good day, Atlanta. As Paul Milliken is live actually here mm -hmm. this morning. Good yeah. to see you. Wait, what are you doing here? I know. It's like, <laughs> yeah. where is he? He's it's here. called Baby Watch, people. <laughs> at any minute, we may lose half of our staff this to babies. True. <laughs> Paul, you got to spend some time exploring this one of a kind place, right? And I love alpacas. Oh, and I'm obsessed with it too. I just told Sharon, I had a vivid dream last night that I was back there again. This is how obsessed I am. When you see this video, you're going to think we shot it in another country. Really, though, it's in East Atlanta, right off of busy I-20. And there are two big draws. One is the actual tree house that people can stay in. The other, the friendly animals that roam right below. To answer the age-old question, which came first? For Kara O'Brien and Kate Giroux, it was the chicken. I started with chickens and they were a gateway livestock. I completely fell in love with chickens and I didn't want to be like a crazy chicken lady. I was going to get goats because that's what people in the city of Atlanta do. You get chickens and then you graduate to goats. But a little internet research led the East Atlanta residents in a much different direction. Come here, ladies. Come here, girls. And instead, they ended up with this growing herd of llamas and alpacas. They are like highly intelligent. They are very much um, empaths. They really like feel what you feel. Oh, here we go. When they first got here, a lot of them were really scared and angry because they had been either abused or neglected. And then to watch them like unfurl into the environment and just come out of their shells, I mean, beyond gratifying. But providing a sanctuary for these natural tree trimmers isn't cheap. And that's why O'Brien and Jero also provide a sanctuary for humans. This is the couple's Atlanta alpaca tree house, built from reclaimed materials like late 1800 stained glass windows and turn of the century church floors and hoisted high above their backyard bamboo forest. It's one of the top Airbnbs in the world, which was very shocking and humbling to us. I mean, we never envisioned that at all. Overnight guests from around the world booked the property, not just as a peaceful place to sleep, but also for the chance to meet the animals. And O'Brien says the money raised through the Airbnb directly supports their rescue efforts. And we have people that like just like thank you so much for opening this to the public. And I'm like, thank you so much for allowing me to help rescue animals, you know, and for really changing my life. A lush green paradise that helps travelers break away from the pack while allowing these animals to be part of a new one. Uh, it's the coolest place in the world. If the Atlanta alpaca treehouse looks familiar, by the way, it's probably because you've seen it featured in several TV shows, including Love is Blind on Netflix and Treehouse Masters on Animal Planet. It's also been in music videos, commercials. I mean, it's all over the place. And if you want to stay there, you can. All right, so we're going to put links on our website, fox5atlanta.com. Look under the Good Day section. You can find it on Airbnb. They also have their own booking website as well that's got all the information about not just the treehouse, but also their animal rescue efforts. And those Aww. llamas and alpacas are the sweetest animals I've ever mm -hmm. met in my life. I want to go spend more time with them. Go on back. That's perfect. <laughs> I'm gonna say, I'll be live from there every morning. That's the new that's the new East Atlanta Bureau. It, it is pretty cool. We have so much to do right here without really even leaving the city. No, no? kidding. Yeah, it's a real getaway. Nice way to de-stress as yep. well. Mm -hmm. All right, Paul, thank you.